Today's video is going to be about tried and tested ways to toughen up, but also about hormones and healing brain and nerve cells. So I try to make videos for people who want to do it naturally and those who want to use a fancy supplement. And supplement today is going to be Bemetil. In fact, the first people to use Bemetil were Soviet astronauts, and Bemetil was used to prepare the USSR's athletes for the 1980 Moscow Olympic Games. So you basically get the idea of the level of sophistication of this compound. Firstly, the natural way. So I'm really into making myself uncomfortable to toughen up. So cold exposure is my favourite for the metabolic effects, particularly balancing the hormone leptin, which is involved in weight, but also the adaptogenic effect. I also use saunas or a really hard, uncomfortable workout and all of the things above are good for your brain and your nerve cells, even if you don't really like it. But what if I wanted to up my workout without using pre-workouts, without using caffeine gear or SARMs? But what if I'm trying to heal a nerve or a brain cell or an injury? Let's talk about Bemetil, which is an actoprotector, and it's a synthetic adaptogen with the ability to improve physical performance. Actoprotectors work in a really interesting way as they enhance how your body functions without increasing oxygen consumption or causing you to overheat. And if for whatever reason your body becomes hypoxic or low in oxygen, this is going to have a terrible impact on your health and performance. And also the end result will be your cells that die without oxygen. So Bemetil is protecting your cells from running low on oxygen as well as overheating. So you basically get used to these environments if you choose to go in them. This is why active protectors like Bemetil are also used for nervous system and brain injuries or healing of brain cells or nerve cells. So they are used medicinally in certain countries as well. So they're classed as safe and they're tested. So look out for my two hour course on quantum healing, which is going to be out next week. And a video is going to come out in a few days on how to deal with troublesome scar tissue and healing peptides. So follow for more and share your thoughts in the comments.